This is day one of PCIM Europe. This is Mark Britton reporting for News from the Future. I'm with Gerard Cronin, VP of Integrated Marketing Communications at ST Microelectronics on their stand in Hall 7. Gerard, we were just speaking about silicon and how you were progressing with that technology. Here, I think, is a different kind of technology that is threatened to upset that balance of silicon, but is nevertheless gaining traction. Maybe you could explain a bit more for us. Sure, absolutely, yeah. So here we're looking at gallium nitride, GAN to its friends, which is a wideband cap technology. So it's one of the, the new technologies like silicon carbide that has been introduced and is indeed revolutionizing a little bit many of the applications that we see in uh, power management. Now, power management is a very wide area. There are many different types of power solutions that our customers need, many different designs. And gallium nitride is something that is, is very interesting for certain applications uh, and is coming in there. What would those applications be? What, what would be a typical application for gallium nitride? Mm. For someone who's not used to that technology, yeah. but they might be thinking, I wonder how I can make my product better. Yeah, so where, where it's really started, uh, and where we've already seen it in consumer applications. So, for example, in power supplies, power supplies for you know, a PC. Something you might just plug into or, a wall or a smartphone. Yeah, we have a typical uh, application here where you see that this board is what's inside that little black square that you yeah. have, uh, where we've been able to reduce by about half the size of the power supply versus what you would have had with silicon. Uh, and it's also coming into other areas now, for example, for onboard chargers for automotive, the auxiliary <laughs> chargers, not the, not the main one, DC-DC converters. This kind of application is now being looked at where size, size and efficiency matters, for example. So what sort of power would we be going up to typically? Yeah, so here, you know, if, if you're talking about something that uh, power charger, you know, this is like 60, 65 watt. Right. And here, you know, 1.2 kilowatts. So that's getting up to the top end, I would imagine. Is well, it? if we go over to silicon carbide, we're talking about 30 kilowatts yeah. power charging solution. So it's still in the, the lower end of the, okay. the power spectrum for basic silicon. So what are the unique features or selling points that maybe ST microelectronics bring to the GAN marketplace? Yeah. So the thing about GAN is, as a new technology, the transistors are actually quite complex to drive and to build to build a solution. So you need your, you need your power stage and you need your drivers and put those together. So in order to simplify that for our customers, we've built a number of solutions where we've integrated the two of them into a single device. So we're offering, you see here, two different ones. Uh, one is more oriented towards uh, the consumer and one is more oriented towards automotive, but basically the two are uh, integrating the technologies in a single device and taking away the, the hassle, basically, of trying to design that on a board with individual components. So you're taking away some of the design work that an engineer might need to put into implementing yeah. that sort of technology and just making it really easy for them to take it to market, which I'm sure a lot of them really appreciate. Certainly when you're looking at the mass market, which is what Future Electronics is trying to do, we appreciate that sort of innovation that ST elect microelectronics are, are bringing to the customers. What do you think Future brings to the party in that uh, particular um, methodology? I think it's really important for us to have partners that understand the technology, that understand what we're trying to do, and how this technology um, can benefit our customers. So it's really important that we work together, well, we, we build, build solutions that uh, we can explain and that we can make available to our partners and that they can then promote to the, a much broader range of customers than we're able to do so directly ourselves. Perfect. Thank you, Jared. Thank you.